Ron Walling of Eldridge has been a Marine and spent a long career in the Davenport Police Department. Local force Eric Zizich reports he's spending his retirement flexing some different muscle in tonight's edition of Veterans Voices. For some, serving our country comes from an inclination that can't be denied. Something inside me just told me this was the right thing to do. Ron Walleen is a veteran who served four years in the Marine Corps as a machine gunner and infantryman. His years in uniform not only helped preserve our freedom, but did profound things in himself. It probably did more to, to shape me and prepare me uh, to become a better person, you know, a better man. That was followed by 30 years with the Davenport Police Department, retiring as a sergeant in 2015, all because of yet another tug from his heart. Going out and chasing bad guys was always fun at, at some level, but, uh, but that's the primary function of the job is to really help people in the community. So, so that's, to me, that's why we did it. That's why, all, that's why I wanted to do it. Through all of that time, Waleen had a liking for motorcycles along with doing body work. That parlayed itself into a new hobby, drag racing. As I got older, it, it was time to get off two wheels and into four. So about five years ago, six years ago, I, I decided I was going to get serious about trying to, trying to learn how to become a good drag racer. His pride and joy, a 1971 Chevy Nova. He's went to work giving it a makeover with a whole lot more power, but it means much more. It is a little bit about identity with me, I guess. That's why I put the American flag on the back. Um, I have a rest in peace sticker on the back from my younger brother that passed before me, uh, my Marine Corps emblem. In a short time, Walleen has already had great success on the track, but for him, his newfound joy lends itself to something deeper. It's not all just about going and winning either. You know, I've, I've met a lot of good people at racetracks. I have friends that I go to the racetrack with. Hoping he can pass on to his grandkids his passion for racing. Most times the kids are just out cruising around playing and having a great time. And yeah, I'd love to see, uh, I'd love to see one of my grandkids get into it. Eric Zizic, Local 4 News.